mambo ya ipoa kama afisa wa polisi kama ule tumeambiwa hapa amechukua bunduki ameingia kwa klabu amelewa amekataa kulipa bill anaua watu as we have no business with those kind of officers wafungwe kabisa hata wasitoke wafungwe milele so ipoa we support your oversight on police officers who misuse their firearms and in the process of misusing their firearms they are adulterating damaging and diluting the splendid and sacrificial work which is being done by 99% of the officers especially those who are working in the front line I have been to every county and every corner of this country including the most dangerous operational area and I want to tell you for those who understand the risk the exposure that our officers go through every day is nowhere near what the discussions in towns is about for that reason sisi tumesema hivi kama sera ya serikali officer wa wote wa usalama awe ni officer wa polisi officer wa jeshi Kenya Defense Force Kenya Prison Service the weapons that you are assigned are weapons bought by the taxpayers of the people of Kenya and the authority that you've been given over those weapons is that you must use them to neutralize dangerous criminals and act fast effectively and lawfully in good time and don't allow a criminal to bring you down or to bring down a citizen while you are holding those weapons i repeat every officer of the national police service of the kenya defense forces and all the other disciplined forces who uses their weapons within the law within the constitution in accordance with the standing orders to protect themselves from being harmed by criminals or to protect civilians and citizens from being harmed by criminals the government of Kenya will stand behind you and protect you and no one will harass you not under the law of Kenya not under international law usikubali maisha yako yachukuliwe na wewe umebeba hiyo silaha kujilinda na kulinda wananchi wa Kenya na tusijumuishe the kind of security operations that most of our officers do in countering the threat of terror in countering dangerous criminals like armed bandits who have terrorized many people in our country we must not confuse those operations with misuse of firearms by 1% a very small minority of our officers who are tainting the image of the national police service and our other formations